hey guys welcome to my youtube channel my name is Rowley. if you are stopping here for the first time it's good to have you here and please do not make it your last okay dear if you're returning og thank you once again you know for coming by um it really means so much to me now guys i know that i've been mia i don't have a solid reason for that i've been busy at work but we're not going to talk about that in this video because i just want to talk about what i came here to talk about so that we move on. now guys without wasting any time let's get right into today's video today guys we are going to be reviewing the trailer of a tribe called judah if you've been on the street of instagram you i'm sure you would have seen the trailer of a tribe called judah a tribe called judah is a 2023 cinematic movie produced by funke akindele directed by funke akindele and ade olua owu and this movie is going to be out in Nigeria cinemas from the 15th of December. <laughs> now guys, let's uh, talk about the uh, movie. A Tribe Called Judah um, tells the story of Jadida Judah, played by Fuki Akindele, um, a mother of five boys with different fathers. Ah, and Jadida is not in my position to judge you. I cannot judge you. I refuse to, I refuse to judge you. Five boys with different fathers. I cannot judge you. Anyways, <laughs> um, it tells the story of Jedida Judah and her five lions. Obviously, these five boys alone, they already made up a tribe. Um, Emeka Judah, played by Jide Kene. Um, Usman Uzi, played Adamu Judah. Timini Ebunzi, played um, Pera Judah. Toby Mackin, they played the role of Shina Judah. And of course, um, last but not the least, we have... Um, Olumide Owori who played the role of Ejiro Judah. That boy father is a worry boy. <laughs> um, so basically, um, the storyline for this movie is about Jadida and her five sons who are trying to take life one day at a time. We can see from the trailer of the movie that their life is not that rosy given the community where they live. And um, Jadida fell sick and obviously life is not all that for Anna boys and um, the boys could not raise our hospital bills so the only option for them was to go rob a furniture company or store in the mall called C and K furniture um, to get their mother's hospital bill so that's how they went to go and rob that's how they went to go and rob you know you plan something and other people say they are planning their own as they are robbing the real ninnies the real ham robbers of the robbers and ninnies children the rig, the rig gang members now came with guns and everything and basically that's how everything just went um, the other way around and yeah i think when we watch the movie we are going to find out what happened after that incident because i have not watched the movie i'm just saying from what i saw in the trailer my expectations for this movie is very high i'm not going to lie number one is funky akindele we're talking about yet hello She's one of the box office queens in Nigeria. So um, this is a second production from a new um, company fan, Fuke Akindele Networks. I have a very high expectations for this movie, a Tribe Called Judah. Um, given Funke Akindele's um, signature style, expect comedy. Comedy, definitely. I mean, I've already seen Uzarukwe. <laughs> so if you watch Iyavara Cat, you know him as Odogu. Okay, so I've seen Uzaragwe, I know that I'm going to laugh a lot. Um, the storyline, I expect a very captivating and engaging um, engaging storyline. Um, the performances, oh my god, I expect solid performance from the entire cast members because none of these faces are new. We've seen them in a couple of uh, big movies and um, they've done absolutely great in other projects that we've seen them in. Guys, Nse Ikmim. A team is in this movie and she plays the role of Coletti, the manager at the C and K furniture, the furniture store that the boys went to rob. Guys, let me tell you, I expect every um you know actor in this movie to bring authenticity and um depth to the roles that they are playing. I know that they are good, they are talented and they're amazing. My expectation for this movie is very, very high. I've seen the cinematography, um, I've seen the costumes. I absolutely love Jedida's costume. Um, the soundtrack as well. Iyajuda. I'm going to download it. Maybe if that didn't come out on any streaming platform, I'm going to download that music and enjoy because I'm still vibing to Omogetsu um, we'll the Saga um, soundtrack. 
a tribe called Judah is definitely a must um, watch. I think you should go to the cinema. No, I think you should go to the cinema come the 15th of December to um, see this movie. And um, if there's one thing I can tell you, if you've not seen the trailer of the movie, you should go watch it. Um, I love the fact that the trailer of this movie effectively teased the storyline, you know, without giving too much away. I mean, mission accomplished is the storyline without giving too much away so go watch a tribe called judah and let me know what you think about this movie come the 15th of december all right guys see you when i've watched a tribe called judah don't forget to like share subscribe and click on the notification icon so that when i post a new video you will be among the first set of people to be notified